Hello YouTube, and this is a video on how to install and make your own server. Here is the final outcome of everything that you should have. Excluding this and yeah, just excluding that. So get this and everything in it. Start your internet up. Go to craft bucket. Link in the description or just look it up. It's craft bucket. Download the uh, uh, first one, which is the newest one. But maybe you should go with this. This is more stable, kind of. Yep, save it as to your desktop. Yeah, save it to your desktop. I forgot to mention you have to create a new folder. Name it anything. Name it anything you want. I'm gonna I'm gonna name it to to. Uh, okay. I'm going to download it. And then I'm going to save it as click there click your desktop go to your folder open save and there you go that's step one step two go to Google Type in Minecraft Go to the website Click download Go to multiplayer server Look for Minecraft server.exe Save it as Minecraft server dot char Type all files and save it to your folder once you're done with that go to your two folder run craft bucket these should all appear now rename craft bucket to something else called just craft bucket without all those numbers Oops. Yeah, yeah, okay, before you do that, if you, if this problem occurs with you, and you can't open it, I mean, you can't rename it or do anything with your server, press Control, Alt, Delete, this works for Windows 7, not sure about the other versions, go to Start Task Manager, scroll down to Java, and end the process. Out, put your folder again, rename, and it should work. Now you go into run the Minecraft server. This might take a while, so hold on. Once it's done. Type in stop at the bottom at your command bar. So it will exit out on its own. Go to server, server, not this server, the other server. It's called a properties file. And change your IP. If you're using a router, change it to your IP. If you're not, if you're using an internet box, don't put anything in this space at all. So I'm going to put in my IP address. I'm not going to tell you what it is though. So you just put it in paste. Get your IP. There's many different ways to find your IP. This is just one. Much. It's going to be useful in running your server. 
So you're gonna put online mode to balls for Minecraft. Balls. Save. Uh, exit out. Create a file. I'm not sure if you can see if you should really run the Minecraft server, but this is the way that I know. So create a new file. Uh, text document. Name it to start. Open it. Paste what's in the description. Don't mind this. It's, it's, Paste. Then save and then file save as start dot b a t bat for batch. Save it as type all files and then X out. Delete your notepad start file and run this file. Let it load. And once it's done. Exit. Uh, this. And you're done. You're ready to go. If you want to automatically be on the op list, the ops list, just open up the ops document, type in your name. Uh, I'm not going to use my name. Type in your name. And it should be ready to go. To add another name, press enter. So here's an example. Mine. That's the first name. Second name, craft. And that's it. You just save it. Then we run the start. That load. And your server is up and running until you close this down. Because exiting out of Hamachi won't shut it down. You have to exit out of this one. And there you go. Look for part two in my videos list or another YouTube video. Cause this is not how to set up Hamachi, this is how to, oh, well, to set up your server. Bye bye.